Okay, we're just showing you now from up at the um, private swims the view you've got across the lake. There you can see, you've got a great view. You can see all the way around there. Okay, we're fishing over on the private swims today, and um, I think we could be lucky. Had a bit of rain last night, and uh, normally after you've had a bit of rain, it turns the carp on. And uh, we've put in about three and a half to four kilo of uh, boilies and we've had a few runs. We've had about three or four pacos, a couple of small red tails. And this one feels a bit better fish. I think this is a carp. So, so we've had him on now for uh, about 10 minutes. I've only just got the video going on this one, but it's definitely a bit bigger fish this. Now I've started fishing out here again, I'm just fishing full time, I don't think I'm going to do any work anymore. These fish are just something else. Oh. oh, that surface then, this looks like quite a big carp. more and more I'm playing with these rods, these century, new century Excaliburs, the more I like them. They're a beautiful rod. You can really play the fish with these. Some of the other rods we've tried out here before have been too stiff or too tippy. This has got a much better through action rod. It's got enough power in to control the fish, but it's forgiving. Which is a very hard job to, to achieve. And I think Century has done a fantastic job building these. lovely over this side of the lake yeah she's got enough trees surrounding here keep you out of the shade it feels like you're on a much bigger lake when you're over this side because you put you're so you're so away from everyone else you could be on like a 15 20 acre lake but uh, Okay, right, we're just going to stop the video there for a second. Oh, just to manage to get him in the net here. Look at that beautiful fish. It's got a massive high back on this one. Oh, this is some fish. Just get him unhooked, we'll be back in a moment. Right. You won't believe what we've caught now. We're over here to this next fish and we've just caught a 100 pound carp. So a giant Siamese carp. Yeah. You have one of these days in a, every now and then. But every now and then seems to come quite often at Top Cats. 
Let's have a little look at this beauty. Oh, look at that fish. Again, he's so strong. I don't think I can lift him. Oh, you can see him there. Yeah. Oh, look at the size of that fish. Massive carp, this one. Oh, we just turn him round for the camera if we can. You can see the width for them. Remember, you know, I'm a 250 pound guy, yeah? And this thing is making me look small. Look, look at the size of that fish. <laughs> Unbelievable. Only at Top Cat. Okay, we've got this one in the net, and uh, I'm more than happy with this one, to say the least. Oh, he's not too happy we're getting caught here. Let's have a little look. Okay. Come on, mate. <laughs> okay, we just had an immense battle here. Like I said, we're having a bit of fishing over on these private swims. And I said, I thought they'd be a little bit special. Well, this fish is a little bit special. This is one heck of a red tail. Now, let's have a little look at this baby. He's sitting on the bottom here. Oh. And if you can see this one. Oh. This red tail is something a little bit special. He's that big. We need a bigger net for this one. Now this one, I can't even lift him, yeah? He's that big. Look at this fish. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's making a noise for us now. About 150 pound, this one. I'm struggling, I can't lift him out the water, this one. He's that big. Oh, what a fish. <laughs> Top cats. World record red tails. Okay. Oh, what a beautiful fish this one. Oh. Okay. 